Did you know that a growing number of Americans are struggling to afford retirement? Life in the United States is becoming increasingly challenging and in today's video we're here to offer guidance to those considering a change. Prices are rising rapidly, and inflation has had a significant impact on everyday living costs. Some people point fingers at corporate greed, while others blame government mismanagement. There are even those who believe this situation is deliberate. So what exactly is happening in America? Let's dive in. Retirees in the United States are facing a daunting economic reality as soaring inflation erodes their fixed incomes from pensions and social security. Prices for essentials like food and energy have skyrocketed, making it difficult for many to afford basic needs such as utilities and transportation. By the year 2023, the average grocery bill for a retired couple surpassed $600 per month, and these costs keep rising. How can retirees cope with such economic pressures when their income remains unchanged? Retirement savings, often tied to volatile 401ks and IRAs, add to the uncertainty of maintaining a stable lifestyle. Healthcare expenses continue to climb, often outpacing inflation. A recent study indicates that a typical retired couple will need almost $300,000 for healthcare costs alone. While Medicare provides some relief, it doesn't cover everything leaving retirees to pay for prescriptions, dental, vision, and long-term care out of pocket. Rising housing costs also burden retirees, with higher property taxes, maintenance fees, and rent. Many are house-rich but cash-poor owning valuable homes but lacking liquid assets. The expense of maintaining a home can be overwhelming, forcing some to downsize or relocate to more affordable areas. Daily expenses such as food, transportation, and utilities continue to increase, squeezing already tight budgets. Retirees often rely on cars for mobility, but fuel and maintenance costs are burdensome, and public transportation is often limited or inconvenient. These economic pressures deteriorate the quality of life for retirees, causing anxiety and depression. Budget constraints frequently lead to cuts in social activities, travel, and hobbies, which are crucial for a fulfilling retirement. Given rising costs of living and inflation, what strategies have you implemented to manage retirement expenses while maintaining a fulfilling lifestyle? Comment below and let me know. The United States, once a beacon of opportunity for migrants and entrepreneurs, now faces formidable challenges. Global competition and economic shifts have transformed the landscape, leading to a decline in people moving to the U.S to start businesses or hire workers, which poses serious economic threats. Projections from the Royal Canadian Mounted Police suggest increasing civil unrest over the next five years as economic dissatisfaction grows among Americans. With the American economy under pressure, how does the global market play a role in these shifts? The U.S. economy feels the profound impact of global competition. Emerging markets in Asia, particularly China and India, have become manufacturing powerhouses with lower production costs, seizing industries once dominated by the U.S. Trade policies have also shaped the economy. While free trade agreements like NAFTA were meant to boost commerce between the U.S., Canada, and Mexico, they have led to outsourcing jobs to countries like Mexico. In response, protectionist tariffs aim to shield domestic industries, but often trigger retaliatory tariffs and trade wars, further straining the economy. This convergence of global competition, technological disruption, and trade policy contributed to downturns like the Great Recession of the year 2008 and 9. The housing market collapse during this period exposed deep vulnerabilities, leaving many retirees with significant financial losses and forcing them to reevaluate their security. By the year 2024, the average retiree's cost of living in the U.S is around $4,000 per month, including housing, healthcare, and other necessities, as per the Economic Policy Institute. Retirees on fixed incomes face severe financial challenges, with stagnant wages and rising costs threatening their standard of living. Healthcare expenses, which can average over $600 monthly, add to their burdens. A Quartz article highlights American Airlines flight attendants who sleep in their cars due to high living costs despite earning over $27,000 annually. This case underscores the broader issues in the U.S. airline industry. 
where significant transformations have often hurt workers, who endure low wages and tough living conditions. Americans often hold preconceived notions about other countries, viewing them as less desirable places to live. Limited exposure to countries like Malaysia, where events such as nomad capitalist live highlight alternative lifestyles, shapes these perceptions. In many nations, strong family ties and community support can prevent homelessness, highlighting stark differences in social structures compared to the U.S. So, how did the U.S. workforce get into such a precarious situation? Before we go any further, if you can help me, please take 10 seconds to hit that subscribe button. It helps this channel a lot. In return, we promise to continue making the show even better for you. Deal? The struggle of American Airlines flight attendants highlights a pressing economic crisis affecting millions of Americans, from young professionals to retirees. At the heart of this crisis lies the widening gap between stagnant wages and skyrocketing living costs, forcing many into financial insecurity. Flight attendants earn an average of $27,000 per year, or just over $27 per flight hour. Even with a proposed 17% raise to nearly $32,000 annually, the increase remains inadequate, especially for junior attendants in expensive states like Massachusetts and Florida. Many are forced to commute to major hubs such as Miami, Chicago, New York's JFK, and Los Angeles, adding further financial strain. Some attendants resort to sleeping in their cars or scavenging for leftover plane meals, underscoring the disconnection between wages and the cost of living in America. This issue is not limited to one industry but is a pervasive problem affecting all sectors of the American workforce. This issue extends beyond the airline industry. Across various fields, wage growth has failed to keep pace with inflation, reducing purchasing power and heightening financial stress. Housing, healthcare and education costs continue to climb, squeezing household budgets, particularly in urban areas. As of the year 2024, living costs in cities like San Francisco and New York surpass $5,000 per month, making basic necessities increasingly unaffordable for many. Retirees, often on fixed incomes, are especially vulnerable, as social security and personal savings frequently fall short in a high-cost economy. Rising health care costs and inadequate pension benefits exacerbate their challenges. On average, retirees spend nearly $4,000 annually on out-of-pocket health care expenses, rapidly depleting their savings. The plight of American Airlines flight attendants mirrors a broader national struggle. Addressing this requires comprehensive economic policies to align wages with living costs, expand affordable housing, make health care accessible, and bolster social security and pensions. The economic challenges faced by these attendants serve as a poignant reminder that without action, millions of Americans will continue to face financial hardship. Creating a more equitable and sustainable economic environment is essential for the well-being of all ages. But where exactly should the blame be placed in this complex web of economic factors? The situation often attributed to late capitalism, as seen through a critical lens, highlights the stark contrast between global poverty reduction and growing economic disparity in the United States. While extreme poverty worldwide has plummeted from over half the population to less than a tenth over the past 60 years, economic inequality in the U.S. continues to widen. This is largely due to government policies and corporate strategies that prioritize short-term gains over long-term stability. Critics argue that the American reliance on past achievements, rather than investing in future growth like other nations, exacerbates these issues. The use of economic sanctions and maintaining power through historical influence is proving less effective in today's interconnected world. Meanwhile, central banks have faced backlash for keeping interest rates too low for too long, leading to inflation and instability. Government struggles with public debt, often influenced by austerity measures, hinder their ability to invest in critical infrastructure and services. Tax policies favoring the wealthy widen income gaps and limit economic mobility. Corporations, in their relentless pursuit of profit, frequently resort to practices that destabilize the economy. Cost-cutting measures such as layoffs and wage freezes diminish consumer purchasing power, stifling economic growth. 
multinational corporations' aggressive tax avoidance deprives governments of essential revenue for public services. The rise of contract and temporary work adds to economic insecurity, leaving many without benefits or job security. Retirees, particularly vulnerable, suffer as inflation erodes fixed incomes from pensions and social security, while healthcare costs soar. Market volatility further threatens those relying on investment-based retirement plans, pushing them toward financial insecurity. If these systemic issues remain unresolved, the consequences will be dire, especially for low-income earners and retirees, intensifying poverty and inequality. As retirees cut back on spending, economic growth slows, triggering job losses and instability. Blame for economic downturns is complex, involves many actors. Governments must implement policies that foster stability and protect the vulnerable, addressing systemic failures to prevent downturns. Corporations also contribute significantly through their business practices, with short-term profit motives, tax avoidance, and cost-cutting at the expense of social responsibility fueling instability. Ultimately, overcoming these challenges requires accountability and collaboration among governments, corporations, and individuals. Efforts to improve the economic system, prioritize sustainability, and protect vulnerable populations are essential for achieving long-term stability. But what happens when personal success clashes with societal expectations and realities? Nomad capitalists can help successful entrepreneurs and investors reduce taxes, secure second citizenship, and find fresh opportunities. Success often brings criticism, with politicians and citizens blaming late-stage capitalism for societal issues without recognizing their own roles. Many, including myself, have left the U.S. for brighter prospects in places like Malaysia. Capital gravitates to where it is treated best, regardless of political backlash. In the U.S., unrealistic expectations for low costs and high wages persist. While CEOs earning $10 million are criticized, the real issue lies in the gap between expectations and reality. Unmet expectations breed frustration, as America yearns for easy prosperity. As the world becomes more competitive, these expectations become harder to meet. Blame often falls on capitalism, but successful individuals must have a plan B. Consider relocating yourself and your wealth to where you are appreciated, avoiding hostility toward success. The unstable U.S. Job market, disrupted by technology and globalization, hinders success, leading to job insecurity and fewer stable careers. In the year 2024, the average wage was around $65,000, while living costs for a single person exceeded $3,000 per month. The wealth gap widens, with the top 1% owning over 35% of the nation's wealth, while the bottom 90% hold less than 25%, fueling disillusionment with the American dream. For many, Finding a better life means looking beyond U.S. borders. Many older Americans and retirees seek countries with lower living costs, like Mexico, Costa Rica, and Panama. In Costa Rica, for instance, a single person can live on about $1,500 a month, allowing retirees to enjoy a comfortable lifestyle on a modest budget. Remote work enables Americans to earn U.S. salaries abroad, maximizing income while enjoying affordability. However, this choice is complex. Job seekers must research local markets and understand salary expectations in their fields. Some sectors offer competitive wages, while others do not meet American standards. Expatriates often experience a higher quality of life, less stress, and a better work-life balance, enhancing mental and physical well-being. Living abroad offers cultural immersion, language learning, and a broader global perspective. Countries like Canada, Australia, Costa Rica, and Thailand have unique advantages and disadvantages for relocation. Canada offers universal health care, a high quality of life, and strong social safety nets, though high taxes and a competitive job market pose challenges. Costa Rica boasts excellent health care, low living costs, and friendly locals but presents limited job opportunities and bureaucratic hurdles retirees and those on fixed incomes benefit financially by living in lower-cost countries, stretching retirement funds further. While the dream of an easier life is enticing, it requires careful planning and understanding of the complexities of living abroad. 
As the world becomes more interconnected, the dream of living and working abroad is becoming increasingly appealing, especially for retirees eager to enhance their quality of life. Many retirees in the United States are grappling with rising living costs, escalating healthcare expenses, and insufficient retirement savings, making it difficult to sustain a comfortable lifestyle. Fortunately, there are solutions and alternatives for those looking to make a change. This is where organizations like Nomad Capitalist step in, offering retirees a way to stretch their savings further by relocating to countries with a lower cost of living. Consider countries such as Mexico, Argentina, Colombia, and Malaysia, where the cost of living is significantly lower than in the United States. In Malaysia, for instance, a retired couple can comfortably live on about $1,500 per month. These countries not only offer affordable living but also high-quality health care at a fraction of the cost in the U.S., which is crucial for retirees who need accessible medical services. Living abroad also enriches retirees' lives through immersion in new cultures, languages, and experiences, which staying in one place cannot offer. Moreover, retirees can benefit from tax advantages like the foreign earned income exclusion, allowing them to earn money overseas without it being taxed in the U.S., providing additional financial security. Nomad Capitalist is an organization that embraces a global perspective, offering unique opportunities for individuals to explore life beyond national borders. They provide solutions for those in developed countries facing economic challenges by helping them relocate to countries with favorable economic conditions. They offer positions like case officers, who assist clients in planning and executing their international relocations. This role offers an annual salary of $32,000, which might be more than some retirees currently earn. Additionally, Nomad Capitalist provides assistance with obtaining a residence permit abroad, further facilitating the relocation process. If you're considering a move abroad, these opportunities could be your gateway to a better life. Retirees interested in these opportunities can visit nomadcapitalist.com to learn more about available positions and apply. While the offer is subject to standard approval processes, it represents a genuine invitation to those seeking a better quality of life and financial stability abroad. For retirees in the U.S. and other high-cost countries, moving abroad can be a transformative decision, offering financial relief and a more fulfilling lifestyle. Organizations like Nomad Capitalist provide the tools and support needed for a smooth transition, ensuring retirees can enjoy their golden years without financial strain. By embracing international relocation possibilities, retirees can find new adventures, friendships, and opportunities while securing a brighter, more stable future. If you found today's video interesting, don't hesitate to hit the like button and subscribe to the Discover Globe channel. Your support is very important to us. Be sure to check out the next video appearing on your screen. You're sure to love the content we bring. Please leave a comment about which country you'd like us to explore next. Thank you for watching, and see you in the latest video. Thanks for being with us on this great journey. Leave your thoughts in the comments and like to help us. Remember to subscribe for more. See you soon.